Welcome back, everyone, to Let's Play The Last Door with me, Selling Graves. Now, let's press right on into this mysterious doorway. What do we got here? An adult woman. She looks really pale. A woman holding a baby. She looks happy. An old, severe-looking man. Severe looking? His gaze unsettles me. Oh, he's like, he's staring severely. That doesn't make sense. I don't know. Maybe I'm just not educated enough to figure it out. A young Anthony, just like I remember him. Dying crow. Yep, that happens down there. A teenage girl. She has a sad face. A young man, one of Anthony's relatives. Oh, what's this? I need to get a closer look, huh? A portrait of Anthony with a stuffed lynx. It looks like he's very proud of his valued animal. The paint looks fresher around the lynx's head. Does it now? Maybe we can... Oh, whoops. Oh, maybe this, old cloth? That would just spread out that fresh paint. Huh. Uh... There's a crow behind the window. It looks like it's trying to get in. Oh, is that what that tapping is? Okay. Hmm. Let's see. Uh. Crow to the window? Nope. The painting? Nope. To anything in this room. No, why would that work? Oh man! I just started! I... Throw the lantern in the window. No. Nope. 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 Nothing works. Wait, wait. Get out of there. Nope. Are you kidding me? Anything? Nothing at all. go up to it, but there's nothing I can do. Hmm. Well, that's troubling. There's nothing I can do in this room. Back out we go. I really hope I can do something with this dying crow soon, because it is right there in my ear and is just mildly annoying. An old wheelchair. It sure is. <sighs> The old corpse lady. Hello. Oh, it's the same woman who was holding that baby in the painting in the next room. In the room next door. She must have been Anthony's wife. She's clutching a note. Yeah, that's the note from before, right? Yeah, yeah, I, I read this already. Huh? Hey, that's new. What's this? A hairpin. Ooh, mayhaps? Did I get that before? No, that couldn't have been. Ah, nothing works here. Can I do anything with this? No. I remember trying to put the hairpin in the crow last time, and that was a big no-no because our character has at least some semblance of a conscience. Let's see. Ah, crap. I can't remember where I've been and where I haven't. Oh. Uh, ding dong. Closed door. Locked with a key. Of course it is. Can we use a hairpin on it? I can't force a lock this tough with this. Oh, man. Wait, put an old cloth on it? Can we burn it? No. Oh, come on, I want to go that way now. Let's go through the door. Um, what about this? I can't open the latch, it's stuck. Small tool, a hairpin! Ha <laughs> ha! Progress! 
Yes, my favorite thing in the world! I managed to open the latch. You sure did, buddy. Excuse me. Oh, what do we got here? A reinforced metal trap door. There's a golden keyhole. Oh. Anyway. This is where I... Yeah, that's where I came from. I stuffed... Links. It looks like the one in Anthony's portrait. Hmm. Well, cloth? No. Of course not. Oh, what's this? What do we got? Some torn out pages. They won't bother me anymore. I'm done with their censorious gazes. Their whispers. It's all ready. There's only one thing left to do. A common hammer, in good condition. Take it! Yes, please! Oh, jeez, do I have to... I'm terribly sorry if this works. I'd rather not kill it like that. Okay, thank you, my good man. Um, what's this? A few press cuttings pinned to the wall. The Illustrated London News, 1887. Judge kills himself under strange circumstances. The Daily Telegraph, 1888. Earl found dead, floating in the Thames. The Times, 89. The famous famous actor found bled to death in his hotel room. Huh. A map of the region with markings on it. Okay, cool. Remains of a chemical experiments. Were they breaking bad in here? Oh, what's this? A can of thinner. Ah! We can use that on the uh, painting. Does that actually work? Like, if you put paint thinner on a painting, does it actually lift the uh, original paint? Or does it just ruin the whole thing? Because I think it's just ruining it. Some sort of spill... Some sort of spilled chemical product. Ah, books! Some strange books. They're written in a language I don't know. English. <laughs> With all the times I stumble over my own words, you really wonder. What's that? Oh, I've unlocked the door. Sweet, fantastic. Wait, one moment. Uh, hammer. The Lynx? Statue? I don't want to smash it with a hammer. Well, you just don't want to do anything, do you? Anyway, moving along. Ah. Perfect. Oh, wait. Uh, this way, right? Yeah, through the broken doorway. Here we go. So now, use the paint thinner on the painting. That's too much thinner. It would ruin the links for good. Oh, I was just saying. Uh, old cloth, maybe? Dip it in there. I dampen the cloth with thinner. Awesome! Wet cloth. A splat. The thinner has worked. The fresh paint around the lynx's head is gone, and now... I can see the original painting. This lynx is different. Its mouth is open, as if it were growling. Could reality have shifted? Let's find out. Whoops. Uh, let's go this way. We no longer have to circumnavigate the globe by using the balcony. We can just go right to the room here. Now, stuffed links. Yeah. But its mouth is shut, like it was before it revealed the original painting. Uh, can we do anything about that? Can we use hammer time now? I don't want to smash it. Okay, uh, rub a crow all over its face? I don't know why that would work, but light it on fire? Nope. Let's... Ah. Uh, 
Well, now I'm done confused again. Stuff blinks. Looks like the one in the portrait, but his mouth is shut. Is there another Lynx statue somewhere? Oh, here we go. Never mind. Trap door locked with a key. Yeah, we know that. Huh. Let's head through here. Let's see. Covered in dust. No one slept here for days. Serious and inquisitive look. Right, right, right. Okay, um... Hmm. Let's head back, then. Maybe something has changed. I mean, we have a hammer. It's got to be something we can do with it. Won't open. By the power of hammer! Nope. Never mind. I light you on fire. I got matches. And I still got the matches, so everything I use that doesn't have a use any further disappears. So I got to use it for something else, I'm guessing. Let's see. The curtains are drawn. They sure are. I'd better leave it alone. Yeah, ain't that the truth. Stuff deer head. That actually looks more like a moose, but okay. Alright, doesn't look like anything of use in here. No. Let's press on. Uh, let, let's go this way. Oh, this just leads back outside. Remnants of the banquet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, what's this? It's just rubbish. That figures. Okay, um... Yeah, back out. Maybe something down the hallway here. Perhaps in here. Maybe this mysterious hole, huh? Tiny dark hole in the wall. Let's put a crow in there? No. Let's put a hammer in there? No. Put the crow out the window? No. Window is fixed now. Empty bowl. Oh, uh, go go in the bowl. Oh, wait, there's something. Are you kidding me? The crow is in the bowl, and it's disturbing as hell. Window is fixed. Okay, uh. So, what then? We just walk out, like... And then, uh... Yeah, he's still there. Hammer the crow now? There we are. Back in. Let's see. I just want to explore this area just real quick before I end the episode. Yodel. Anybody's? There's some firewood. T light it on fire! I don't need to light a fire here. Yeah, sure. D believe whatever you like. Alright, no, that that's definitely not the right way. Um... Cement is still fresh in this wall. Wait a minute. Hammer the wall! I don't want to make a mess. Oh, come on! What? You just... Light it on fire? Light this thing on fire? Light something on fire. Ugh. Okay. Hmm. I am at a loss. It's something to do with that Lynx statue. Or, not statue, the stuffed Lynx. It's gotta be. I don't know. But I'll have to continue this on in the next episode. For now, thank you all for watching. This has been Let's Play The Last Door. With me, Zillion Graves. And I will catch you all next time. Later.